Boyne City off to a great start, still undefeated in the state semifinals for Division 6. Their obstacle to get to Ford Field, taking down the 68-game win streak of the Ithaca Yellow Jackets, the second longest active streak in the country. And right away, they're already at 14-6, and they're going to get QB Jake Smith down in the end zone. That's right, a safety. This puts them up 16-6. to Things are looking great for the Ramblers, but the Yellow Jackets do get the ball back. Smith on his feet again, runs into the end zone, gets the TD for the Jackets, makes it 16-14 to at that point. Now in the fourth, late in the fourth. Boyne City down 20-16. to The Ramblers have the ball. They're in the two-minute drill in the fourth down. Senior QB Max Cooper to tight end. Cole Butler, beautiful connection there. Gives them a first down. They measure it. Cooper hands it off then to Mac Alexander. Who makes a nice cut up field. Jukes, the Yellow Jacket defender, gets a huge gain. This is all under a minute to go in the ball game. Taking it all the way to the seven yard line where they get another set of downs. Unfortunately, they could not punch it in those other set of downs. The season ends for the Ramblers. They fall 20 to 16. But uh, impressive fashion. They're one of the best teams in the state. Amazing year. It's, it's been a phenomenal ride, and, and, and they're great kids. I mean, they're, they're a lot of fun to be around, a lot of fun to, to work with every day, and uh, couldn't be prouder of, the, of this group of kids. That's a lot of fun, right? The Ramblers finished the season 13-1, definitely sending a message to northern Michigan as well as the rest of the state. At Boyne City, it's here to stay as contenders on the gridiron. <laughs>